All right, this is a video of the quiz's review. So what is 45 degrees in radians? It's 45 pi over 180, and then you simplify it to pi over 4. And what's the equation for the following graph? So if I look at this graph, um, if I want to do no phase shift, I would use cosine, but uh, this is using phase shift here. So phase shift for sine would be pi over 2. That's not it. But uh, for cosine, it would be a negative cosine would be pi over 4 would be the phase shift. So it's this one. Oops. I didn't take into account the... Uh, period there, so that's why I got that one wrong. Uh, the graph of y equal 6 sine bx minus h plus k is shown. What's the value of b? So you want to look at this graph here and find out what the period is. So if this is negative pi over 3, this would be positive pi over 3. So it looks like, or if I go from half of a uh, Half of a period would be from negative 5 pi over 2 to pi over 2. So that's 3 pi. Yeah, this wouldn't be pi over 3. So this is from here to here is 3 pi. So this whole period would be uh, 6 pi. So 2 pi over 6 pi is one third. What's the period of this? It would be 2 pi over 2, which is pi. What's the amplitude here? It's uh, 0 to 1. So 1. You have to type that one in. And then Kim's right up first with diameter 72, center 40. Assume Kim starts the right hand side. So uh, center is plus 40, and diameter 72, so half of that is 36. So it's 36 sine of theta plus 40. The Ferris wheel, it's, what's the height of the highest seat? It would be 35 plus 20 would be 55. Uh, period of sine or cosine can be found by doing uh, 2 pi over b. Uh, what is the degrees between each seat here? You just count the seats. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Add that 360 divided by 12 would be 30 degrees. What's the equation of the graph again? So once again, uh, we're doing a phase shift here and if I do a sine curve, so a sine curve would be right here, pi over 2. Or that's a negative sine of 3 pi over 2. And let's see, at pi be a negative cosine, so it's this one. The period of this graph here, it's going from 0 to 1080.
the Thomas of Ferris wheel centers at 51, radius 45. So 45 sine of beta plus 51. What's the equation of the midline? Might as well use the double up points here. It's going to be y equal 4. This number here. What uh, function? I think it's just supposed to say the greater amplitude. This has an amplitude of 3, and this one has 2. It's a period of the graft function. So you're going from negative pi over 2 to 7 pi over 2, which is 8 pi over 2. That's 4 pi. How many radians does the circle have? 2 pi radians. Uh, 225 degrees in radians with 225 pi over 180, and then simplify by divided by 45, which is 5 pi over 4. Uh, which equation does the graph represent? So if I start right here, it would be a positive cosine. And each one of these, that's pi. This is pi over 2. This is uh, pi over 4 would be the starting point. And 2 pi is the, so it's this one here. Starting point pi over 4, the period was 2 pi for that one. This one, 3 cosine x minus 1. The center line is negative 1, so this is the only one that has a center line of negative 1, letter C. That person goes for a ride. Uh, lowest start at the lowest point, so it's a negative cosine curve. And then from 7 to 92 would be 85, and half of that is 42.5. So I can eliminate this one and this one. So it's either this one or this one, and you have to take the radians divided by the period. So. One fifty pi over one eighty, one fifty divided by thirty is five pi over six, one eighty divided by thirty is six, so five pi over six. And then which the following is two sine of x minus pi over six, so you're having a phase shift on a center line of pi over six. That's this one here, D. And then which the following is the graph of X minus pi over 4. So cosine uh, graph where the phase shift, a positive cosine graph looks like this one here. Yep. This is a, a phase shift of pi over 4 with a period of 2 pi. This letter B. And this one is difficult. I've missed this one before because you can't really see 
then when you try to click on these to make it bigger, you can't really see what the graph is, but uh, you're, it's going to be a negative cosine curve. These are all negative cosine curves. This one looks like the period is too wrong. Can't really read the scale here, but I'm pretty sure this is the answer right here. Yeah. So that one, I can understand you miss it because you can't really see the numbers on the scale. Uh, Ray A is riding on radius 50s, center 75, so 50, and the right hand side, there's a 50 sign, uh, plus 65. And then once you mark everyone, it's right. So it's the other one. Does a negative value call, cause a reflection over the x-axis? <laughs> Let's see, amplitude. So this center line is one and so the amplitude is one half. Uh, what's the value of K? Or what's the value of K is the center line here of this graph. So that's Y equal four or four. Uh, 20 feet, 35 is the degrees, so there's 10 spokes here, 360 divided by 10, 36. What's B if the period is 4 pi, so 2 pi divided by 4 pi, 1 half. Uh, so if you start at the lowest possible point, that would be a minimum negative cosine. What's the value of H here? So you have a negative cosine curve would be right here. So two pi is one of them and that's right here so and then the person uh, which uh, which equations model this so once again this is 85 feet between the two the center line would be at 42.5 these all have 42.5 in them so we can't pick that way they all have 2 pi over 267. So you're looking for phase shift, the right, correct phase shift here. Here's a cosine curve where it starts at, look like 133.5, so that one. And then a sine curve starting at uh, 66.75. And what's the amplitude of the, the graph function? So from negative three to five is eight. So, or you find the average of five plus negative three is two divided by two is one. The center line would be at one and the amplitude would be to go one to five would be four. And the amplitude here, you're going from zero to three on the Y would be three. And the Ferris wheel, what's the height of the lowest seat? seat would be 35 minus 20, would be 15.
So I missed that one question because of the the period there, but I guess I got a redemption there. So uh, 